Hello, I'm Sophie. I'm sure my problem is close to anyone or will be close in future. I want to talk to you about college admission exams. But, well, any type of very important exams will do to prove my point. I want just to tell you how the necessity to study and pass those exams with high score may turn your life into hell. Actually, now that I'm going to tell you my background, I feel that college admission is the most important point of my life. I mean, all my actions in my existence so far were meant so that I could pass my SATs with top votes and enter an Ivy League university. My parents came from China and I was born in America. They had a hard life so that I could get access to all the opportunities in order to excel in life. Thank you, mom. Thank you, dad. I appreciate and I want to make you proud of me. The only question is what that pride costs me. I started learning math at a very early age. My dad is actually very good at it, so he became my first tutor. When I went to school, all the kids were slowly studying addition while I was already good at decimal division. This is of course not a bad thing. The only difficulty was that I was studying math every evening after school. What do children normally do after school? Sports? Hobbies? Going out with friends? Forget it. You need to study in order to enter Harvard. Harvard is a very abstract notion for a seven-year-old child. So in my imagination, it was like a paradise full of elves and cotton candy where I can finally relax. However, if your parent says that Harvard is your objective in life, you trust him without asking too many questions. That is why in all these years, I embrace the fact that the only mark acceptable for me, not only in math, but any other subject, is an A. Even an A- minus is a failure, and it means that I need to study harder. Please don't misunderstand me. My parents love me a lot. This attitude actually shows that they care for me getting all the best in life, without necessity to pass all the hard moments they have had in their lives. My only problem with this is that this race wears you out. I have a strong fear of making a mistake, that's a lower mark, and it drives me crazy. As time was passing, I was studying more and more intensely. I'm now a senior, and if I look back at all my childhood years, I remember endless books, test papers, and studies, studies, studies. My happiest memories are birthday parties of my schoolmates where I eventually went and times when I could go out to the cinema or just to hang out with my friends, whom I surprisingly managed to get considering constant lack of freedom.